Okay, so so far we have our mot. We used loft to create that. And then we dug a moat. We used extrude a taper to get that. And now we're going to create our castle walls on top. I'm going to show you a couple tools, things like trim and mirror. And we're going to use offset again to draw this. So let's right click and make a new sketch up here on top. Okay, and now we're going to use mirrors. We're going to draw like half of our castle. You can draw any kind of shape. I'm just going to use line tool. I'm going to make a pretty standard castle here. Okay, and with this line, you can make the middle wherever you want. So first I'm going to make that line right down the middle where I want my castle to go from one side to the other. And since my thing has this funny shape like an arrowhead, I'm going to draw this line right through the middle. Okay, it makes really no difference. Exactly, that's like my mirror. Okay, so pretend that's your mirror. And now I'm going to draw half my castle on one side. So I'm going to draw my little shape of my castle here. All right, so off I go. And if you want it perfect, you can see as I'm going, you can make the you can type in numbers and see how that degrees changes. So I can make it 90 degrees so I get perfect lines. Because you see over here I didn't make a perfect 90 degrees. But that's up to you. How be as precise as you want. And let's say I want to make a couple towers on this thing. So I'm gonna add some towers to it. Okay, so I'm gonna put some towers on the corners, like so, like just a little one here. And as long as we're doing it, might as well put one on every one. Okay, and again, you can type in to make them all the exact same size. I'm just going kind of fast. Now the tower, but it's cut. I don't really like that, so I'm going to use something called trim. I'm going to trim this part. I'm going to trim off those inner corners. So we do like that. All right, we're looking kind of like a castle. Now we're going to mirror this thing. This is what I really wanted to show you was mirror, because mirror can make your life super easy. So we're going to go up to the top, and we're going to click mirror. And it's going to say select. What would I like to mirror? I'm going to mirror all this stuff. So I'm going to go click every line that I want to mirror. And then I can click the mirror line. And that's what I drew here in the middle. Remember, that was my mirror that I did. And I'm going to say apply. And look, it doubled the size of my castle. And now I can say done. And there's my castle twice as big as it was. But the castle walls, they're not thick. We've got to have thick walls. So we're going to go back and use that offset again. Click on that, and look, we can squeeze it in. And again, you can type in here. Okay, but I'm just going to guess and put it right there. Okay, and look how wonderful these things are looking. It's starting to look like a castle. Well, if you want these to have thickness, you can do the same thing. You can go do the offset on each one of those. And we could have done it before we did the mirrors, so then I didn't have to do it a thousand times, right? So sometimes you have to do a little pre-planning. But you just click. It's not that hard. And if you want to make them the same, you just have to type. And now you can see... They were creating these castle walls. So if I finish the sketch, okay, and then I go over here to extrude, what would I like to extrude? Well, I want to extrude just those outside parts. I mean, sorry, those little inside wall parts. See how I click that? It's hard to get sometimes. Click in. Look, I made the walls. Well, I want that to extend up too, right? I want those on the other side. So I got to turn over here so I can see those to get those towers to get taller too. And now I'm making walls with towers, right? I'm going to do it to this side. And then these, since I didn't offset, right, I can make solid towers. And that might be what you want. So it just depends on what you want. This one's so wide open on what you can do. You get to really use your creativity and do what you want. But you can see now that I'm starting to get a castle as I go. And I can make it taller, right? If I wanted to make it taller, I could make it 0.5 or something and make taller walls. So it starts to look like a castle, OK? Now remember when you're extruding, you can only do one extrude per uh, sketch. So I can't extrude the tower taller than I do these walls. It'd have to be a totally different sketch, which you could also do. Okay, but that's just simply how to get started. And you can see I make a pretty fancy castle, and it didn't take very long by using something like mirror.